guys welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a brand new video so today i'm actually doing a different style of video um so i'm actually going to be doing like a 24 hour challenge kind of thing so it's a bit different to my usual hauls and that all my light-hearted vlogs so if you don't know already there's an app called too good to go which i'll leave on the screen here too good to go is an app where you buy like all of like the end of line discounted foods at the end of the day and they have so many shops and restaurants on there it's unreal they have like greg's wenzel's supermarket stores like asda and co-op they also have like pizza express and like yo sushi but basically how it works um i'll show you here but it's basically like all of the items in the area for this i'll show you like london because it will have so much more than where i am but yeah it basically shows you all of the items up for sale in the area they actually go quite quick so you've got to be quite snappy um and basically you pay it's normally between three to five pounds and you buy what's called like a magic bag loads of little bits that like are discounted on that day or like going out of date the next day all the stuff are never like out of date that's normally like the last day they're selling it so they have to get rid of it um but you normally get so much for your money I used to like buy this and have it for like dinner sometimes just for pure excitement it will cost us three pound and it will get us both dinner um but yeah i've basically been seeing this all over tiktok at the minute so i think it's getting like a lot more popular so i actually wanted to try a lot more places than i have already so at the minute i've planned it so i have like early midday afternoon and dinner so i've timed it quite well but i didn't realize the locations of all the ones i bought so i've got a bit of driving to do today look at the bottom it shows you like the orders you've placed so far um so you can click on the ones and it'll tell you the collection time because you have to collect within a certain period it's normally when they close or like change their stops from like breakfast to lunch etc i've got costa um which is collection from like when it opens to like midday kind of time so i'm gonna go there now so i can have that to start after that i've got like a hotel breakfast from the holiday inn um i've read online it's like fry ups and like pastry and then yeah later i've got greg's and wendell's which i'm most excited about but yeah i might buy like something sweet in the middle of the day if something comes up i don't know i'm gonna keep an eye on the app and i'll keep you updated um but yeah i'm gonna go to costa now so this is the little outfit of the day so far with my little tripod you know so i've just got a big baggy jumper some black leggings and my fresh air force i don't know if i want to get them dirty but they are beaming so i just need to get them dirty and then yeah i've got big fluffy borg maxi coat from pretty little thing okay i've just arrived and honestly i am starving so i'm so excited but yeah, i'm just gonna walk over now and go get the bag Right, so I'm back in the car and like this bag is full and like I was watching her pick out my stuff and she was the nicest lady ever and she was picking out my stuff and she just kept picking stuff and I was like, oh my god, this is the best day ever. Oh my god. I paid £3 and it's literally full. Like I'll show you what I've got. That's my hand and compare. Like it's basically full to the brim. So first of all, I got a vegan meatball wrap and yeah, I mean, I'm not a vegan, but I'm going to give it a good go. Um, so yeah, I got that. And then I also got Cajun chicken pizza wrap, which that sounds insane. Like, oh my God. I know Ryan's going to love this, so I can't eat this yet. I'm going to have to wait and eat it with him because he's going to love it. Then I got a roast chicken and bacon toasty, which, oh my God, yum. And I also got a ham and cheese toasty. I've got so many toasties, it's unreal. Then I also got smoky ham and cheese toasty which is a vegan one got a cheese and tomato toasty as well so i've got four toasties two wraps for three pounds and i'm not even done yet so i've literally got a whole cake basically i don't know what flavor it is actually i think it's um lemon drizzle maybe which i love lemon drizzle so i'm so happy with that and then last of all i've got like six of these like biscuity things like caramel they look insane but yeah rocky road i think they're more like caramelly or like maybe like this coffee i'm not really sure i might look at the menu and see what they are but i've got like six of them four of them two wraps and four toasties for three pounds like sorry but I, either i came to a good shop at a good time or that is amazing the last cost one i got did not have this much stuff i'm so happy it's so easy to do like you go in and then where you click on like your orders you just click on the place you're collecting from so i clicked on costa and then at the bottom you just swipe left to say you've collected it and you just show them the code and it's easy and then you just leave and then you've got so much food i just looked online and i can confirm 
This is a Lotus Biscoff Rocky Rose. How beautiful does that look? And yeah, that one's definitely a lemon cake. I looked online as well, but like lemon drizzle cake. I'm back home and I'm actually, I'm still a bit in shock at how much I got to be honest. I was not expecting that like at all. Um, I do need to go and collect the holiday in breakfast at 10.45 and it is five past 10. So I need to go in like 20 minutes or so. So basically the whole too good to go thing is basically means it's going out like that's the last day that they can like sell it. Like the use by date is today. So all of these are 22nd of April which is the day I'm filming this. I'm not gonna eat too much because I do have a fire out. So I'm just gonna have one of these Biscoff Rocking Rose because they look beautiful. That is so good. That's so nice. It's very like rich Biscoff, but it's good. Look how good that looks. Okay, so next it's time to go to Holiday Inn. I feel like everyone knows what Holiday Inn is. But if not, it's a hotel chain um, and they do obviously do like buffet breakfast. It's basically the breakfast you get if you stayed at the hotel. So it'd be like a little fry up, pastries. So I'm not actually sure on having a fry up in the box and then taking it away. I don't know because there's going to be like beans and stuff. I don't know. I need to just like see what it looks like. And then, yeah, I'll bring it home and warm up if I like it. I'm here. I mean, it's kind of messed up. I kind of shook it about, but I've got tomatoes. I've got sausages, free sausages, mushrooms. Ignore me, there's more sausages here. Loads of sausages. There's beans at the back. Um, and then, yeah, like mushrooms. So just like a mini fry up actually. And I love scrambled egg. I'm glad it's not a fried egg because I don't know, that would have cringed me out. Okay, I'm back home and I'm a bit of an overthinker, okay? And I'm overthinking this breakfast. I don't know, it's just, I'm worried, like, because obviously this is like the buffet food they have in hotels, but it's been out, like breakfast is finished. So it's might have been out quite a long time, I don't know. I'm not really sure. Why the lot of egg? Like a lot of egg. I've really messed it up, but there's like five sausages in here. I don't know, I think I might just eat a sausage and go from there. In a box, it's not that appetizing. I'm just gonna have like two sausages and then I'm just gonna have to call it a day with this, I can't lie. Okay, I can't lie, I haven't eaten a lot. I ate that little gap there, like I had a sausage and a half and I just couldn't do it. I don't know, I think it's just because it's like it's got cold now and I don't wanna warm it up because I don't know how much it's been warmed up and I know you can't reheat food like certain amount of times i don't know and the egg's just not doing it for me i think i'm just being really picky i think i'm overthinking because i love a fry up and it actually looks good but i think it's the egg that's put me off and the egg's kind of all over it i'm probably gonna have a toasty now to be honest okay i've got my toaster machine warming up it's ready to go and then i've cut the ham and cheese toasty in half this is the one with like the cheesy top look at that that looks gorgeous Confused, confused, confused. I'm just watching it. I find this so satisfying, like the crackling noise. So I'm just sat here watching it now. I made a really rookie error. I didn't oil it. And now the bread's stuck. Oh my God. Oh, this isn't the best thing I've ever made, but <laughs> I'm gonna have to make do because I can't toast it anymore because I didn't oil it. And now I need to clean it because it's all sticky before I can toast another sandwich. So, great. Good one, Lucy. That's really good. Although I taste a bit of mustard, not gonna lie. I feel like it's that mustardy cheese. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm just going to get my, I don't know what time it's meant to be. I think it's four, it's half three till four o'clock, so I need to get my move on. I'm going to get my Greg's now, so I'll see you when I'm there, because I'm in a rush now. Okay, I actually forgot to vlog when I got out of Greg's, but I'm now like in my local shopping centre because I need to go get pick up some bits and return some bits. Basically, a little admin day, but it's like 4.15 now. Um, so yeah, I've got my Greg's delivery. The last one to get now is Wenzel's, which is at 6pm. 
there's also one more line which is starbucks but i don't think i need any more food to be honest so i'm not gonna get a fifth one i i do i'm just hoping there's something sweet in this greg's bag or in the wenzel so here's the greg's i mean i'm not gonna lie from first feels it's quite light normally greg's pull through it's last there so i think i might have got a small bag maybe serves me right eh so this is what it's looking like so first we've got a oh love that little chocolate muffin then we've got a a bake i don't know what flavor it is i'm not going to open it until i get home because i can heat up then but i've got a bake of some kind and then last of all i've got a little tandoori chicken baguette which i love these so i'm really happy with that a bit smushed but we know but that looks really nice to be honest minus the smushy packaging um but yeah i'm actually quite happy with that to be fair you'd buy just the baguette for three pounds i basically got a cake and a bake for free so that's actually quite good i'm quite impressed with that actually so yeah i've had better greggs let's just put it like that but that is still a quite a good greggs to be honest like, to be fair at least i got all of the stuff that i actually liked and would eat like i love a chocolate muffin i love that tandoori chicken baguette and i also love a bake like the only bake i don't like is cheese and onion so i really hope it's not that but ryan likes cheese and onion bake so that's all stuff that people like so it's not going to go to waste at all so i'm glad it's like less quantity but like better stuff if that makes sense um but yeah i'm happy with that i'm just going into my town now to go and like do a little bit of shopping a bit of tlc for myself um and then i'm gonna pick up the wenzels after so i'll come back to you when i pick up the wenzels Right, I picked up my Wenzels and it's so heavy. There's so much in it. <laughs> Can you stop laughing at me? So I've got three mini yummies. They actually look quite good to be fair. I've never had a yum yum. Oh my God. I've got Jubilee donuts, two of them. I don't know what flavour they are, but they're cute. I think they're jam filled. Ham salad sandwich. A tomato, mozzarella and pesto panini. A chicken and bacon sandwich. And... <laughs> a fat loaf of bread. So I literally got all of that for £3.50. And again, Wenzel's is putting through. Greg's didn't, but Wenzel's did. So for a total of £15, excluding the disgusting breakfast i didn't eat i got all of that for 15 pounds and literally like one of them is like four quid so it's actually a bargain so that is actually everything i got from too good to go today so everything was actually really good to be fair apart from the breakfast but we don't talk about that um but yeah i'm really happy with everything wenzel's was definitely the best i'd say like that is like solid 10 out of 10 i was gonna have the tandoori chicken baguette for dinner and i had a little bit and it's insane um, but yeah, you definitely need to go have a look at this app because there's so many nice restaurants on there and new restaurants come on like every week. So you couldn't recommend Too Good To Go Enough. Like it's honestly insane. But if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. Do subscribe to my YouTube channel down below and also follow me on my Instagram, which I'll leave on the screen here. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.